dust to dust in our inspiring privilege to commend her soul to our maker, father, and redeemer in the confident hope of the coming again of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, the resurrection of the body from the grave, and the joyous life reserved for the children of light in the realms of glory. Let us recite the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever. Now may the saving grace of our Lord and our Savior Jesus Christ, the love of God our Father, and the sweet communion of the Holy Spirit rest, rule, and abide in our lives henceforth, now, and forever. Amen. Amen. Let us at this time receive Alexander Funeral Home as they have a presentation for this family. They summed it up by saying she was a hard worker, she was strong, she was caring. She was a feisty woman. She was loving. She was very bossy. Some of the most important events or special moments in her life would have had to be the birth of her children, Ran, Tam, and Fran. And I'm sure T and Vontina met her at the gate when the Lord called her home. Dot Lee, as she was officially called by her family and friends, was a woman who was full of life. She knew the Lord and loved the Lord with all her heart, her mind, and her soul. She will be missed by all who knew her. She had many hobbies and many talents, which included cooking, sports, particularly basketball, excuse me, baseball, excuse me, basketball, and bowling. And she loved to sew. On the weekends and her free time, you will find her watching her sports and being around her family and her friends. Dot Lee's favorite color was maroon, her favorite vacation place was Bahamas. Her favorite television shows was ESPN. <laughs> and she loved the reel. I'm, I'm told that she was very upset when they took Tamar off the reel. <laughs> her favorite sports team was the Golden State Warriors. And I'm sure she, it was because she loved Stephon Curry. Yeah. Her favorite quote or favorite saying she might say quite often was, Paul, oh, thang. shut up. <laughs> her favorite food was steak and she loved strawberries yeah. her favorite snack and chocolate bar was Reese cups and her favorite drink was sweet tea her favorite music was gospel music and her favorite song was oh happy day yeah. family noticed i placed a rose in your chair for those of you who are seated and for those of you who are standing i have some rose petals to the table here at the end of this service, you may take these items and place them here and leave with Ms. Dot Lee, or you may keep them as a keepsake. So in honor of Dot Lee on today, we, the staff of Gethsemane Memorial Gardens, have set up a tribute table in her honor that displays some of her favorite things, including some steak and some strawberries. And we do have some sweet tea back there as well. For those of you who are seated are able to take with you her favorite chocolate bar, which is some Reese cups. We're gonna ask that you eat them before they melt in your hand. Yeah. <laughs> We want to say thank you so much for allowing Gethsemane to serve you. You would notice a staff member of Gethsemane taking pictures on today and also some register pages that will be passed around for you to sign. We ask that all of you would take advantage of these items. Would they be bundled together in an album and presented to this family at a later date? In closing, family, I want you to know that we will care for Dot Lee as we care for our own family members who are already here at the Gethsemane Memorial Gardens. We commend you to God for comfort. And we simply say unto you, cast all of your cares upon the Lord, for he careth for you. For the scripture reminds us, gives us hope and assurance to know to be absent from the body is to be present with the Lord. For weeping may endure for a night, but we have the assurance that joy will come in the morning. At this time, we're going to ask that the minister will greet the family. After the greeting of the family, we're going to ask that all of you will join us in the yard area where we'll have a symbolic dove release ceremony in honor of Dorothy Simmons on today. After which, we're going to ask that you come back under the tent for just a few moments as we continue to celebrate her life here at the Gethsemane Memorial Gardens before this Alexander staff take you back to your means of transportation. Upon your dismissal on today, the cemetery custodians will come to take that lead to her final resting place, which is in the Haven Arrest Guard, where she'll be surrounded by her family, T, 
and also Vantina. May God bless and may God keep each and every one of you on today. Amen. 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 Go, Grandma! Go! Going over there with her son and her daughter and her son-in-law. See you later, Grandma. I love you. He right there. Yeah. Come on, love you.